door. How many people do you know suffering with the cold and the flu right now? Oh, the cold and flu season. We know this it's, from the commercials yeah. for Dristan that it's this is there. cold and flu season. It's out there. All right, mm -hmm. we have a New York City nutritionist and the founder of Park Avenue Nutrition, Lisa Cohn. She's here this morning with some ways to boost your immune system for a healthier you. Hello, welcome. Glad to be here. Uh, Lisa, you sound like you need to be eating some of these foods right now. No, I'm now. just pretending for the show because I really want you to understand by the end of this, it's going to be gone. Okay. <laughs> Even a super healthy nutritionist can get the whole cold. Lisa, what can we do to, uh, you know, f uh, uh, fend off uh, illness? Well, food can be thy medicine. So, we have a lot of good stuff here. Fresh herbs and teas, mushrooms, berries, herbs and spices, and hot peppers the whole family of garlic and onions, and we've also got some dairy products that are great. All right, let's tonic. start with tea. We always hear that green tea is good for you. Why? Absolutely. The anti-inflammatories, or what we call catechins, are just wonderful on the cellular level. And we could talk a lot of science, but I also want you to think flavor and smell, aroma, all that warming good stuff, because that embodies a lot of the reduced immunity suppressors. Terrific. Lisa Cohn, also, is this a... Uh preventative should I should I start before I get the cold or during the cold I like you you're into nutrition you believe in prevention right. so always all year round all great stuff yeah. that you can try does chicken soup help it does the chicken breast <laughs> has a certain amino acid that's very helpful but we know the garlic that's in there Garlic, garlic and onion family. I like that. Alliums. It's like perfume in our family. Well, if you eat enough of it, some people uh, uh, say it is. Hey, I'm not into voodoo, all right? Let's put that down right <laughs> I like now. That. I plays with the food. It's good. Okay, but the mushrooms. Let's talk about the presentation. You can't have a bowl of mushrooms like that, right? Ah, but could they be very nicely sautéed with some olive oil or in a, even with a pasta? Right. Of course. Or even grilled. Mm -hmm. And berries are great for the immune system. Mushroom berries. Berries always excellent. Do you okay. love them? Is, is Fresh there, yes. and a smoothie. Is there a food that's bad for the immune system? Ah, uh, yeah. Like what? what? Those junky, sugary, processed white flour. Makes you more susceptible so, to illness? Yes, they pull out the B vitamins and the C vitamins that really are the immune boosters. Huh, that's interesting. So, you know, when we eat, we want to get kind of our value there. What, what does yogurt do for you? Well, yogurt has natural probiotics, and many people forget that the gut is the first spot for better immune system. The gut is system. the first spot for better, what do you mean by that? That's the bank. That's mm. where the goods go in. So if things are being absorbed better, yeah. you're gonna have a much better immune Lisa, system. Lisa, if it doesn't say probiotic on it, does that mean it doesn't have it or does all yogurt have pro probiotics? All yogurt it? has some. Because, there's, you because there, are, you know, there are certain yogurts that advertise that they're good for the immune like system. Like this one. Yeah. And what I want you to do is go for a really straightforward one. We don't need all the extra goodies. We just want the real stuff. Mm. So even a plain yogurt is great. Like a, a Greek one is higher in protein also. What about the, the one, we won't name names, that has the fruit on the bottom that you can stir up? Bring it in just for taste, and that's it. Okay. All right. Because those high sugars are not so great. Lisa Cohn, thank you so much. Good information this morning. All right. Cheers. Happy, healthy. You too. Year. What's the name of your organization? Park Avenue Nutrition. Nice. Excellent. All right, for more information on her tips, go to our website, myfoxandwine.com. Click on the Good Day tab. There's also information on Lisa's DVD, Living Room Yoga, Relax and Detox. You didn't, we didn't even talk about yoga. You're into yoga, too. Absolutely, because it's all about de-stressing, and all these foods naturally detox you. The mind and the body have to work. Is it really necessary to have a mat? Everyone's talking about the mat in yoga. Can't you just do it on the floor? It's Why do you have to have a mat? carry the mat. It's the thing. Right. Ay, ay, ay. This is like 101. Can we go with, uh, let's talk about what's coming up next. Our big superstar, Felicia Rashad, Yay. is going to be here. We have a new movie.